10:30. Armored. Congratulations, Captain. You got the City Hall bomber. We got him. Tomato, tomato. My point is, you've been burning the candle at both ends lately. You should take a vacation. I'm not exactly the tourist type. But once we've rounded up the rest of Lee's people, maybe I will. No planes, no suitcases, just uninterrupted sleep. Oh, you are a party animal. But hey, whatever floats your cruise ship. Or doesn't. You've earned it. I wish I knew who made this comic about me. Kid's got a future. Stick to your MO, don't you? One down. The secondary bombs are on a timer, though. Gotta hurry to disarm them. Officer, stay safe. There it goes! Wonder if pigeons eat spiders. The 
demons are turning the city into a war. Okay, the people in the top floor apartments are really annoyed with you right now. Appreciation on the Sable guys is all the reward I need. Or is that constipation? Oh yeah, that blind guy gave me his card in case Spider-Man ever needs a lawyer. Wait, hold on. If he's blind, how did he know I was Spider-Man? Okay, let's see what's happening inside. Geronimo! MJ, I'm at location number two. Can you believe these demons wear their masks just like walking around? Let's make for confusing staff meetings. I'll try to figure out their operation while you throw a wrench into it. Nap time.
were all waiting next door until I thought I'd won just to be mean, weren't you? Here, it looks like Lee took over a legitimate auto repair business. Explains where the demons get all their vehicles. Trucks, ambulances. Exactly. If you shut this down, they'll have a tougher time moving around the city unnoticed. I would hate to see the group text that got you all here! MJ, I may have just done the opposite of repair at this repair shop. Don't worry, I'll get the cops down there. They'll clean things up. Spider signal! Cool idea, but any light source that made it bright enough was also way too hot. Someday, though. Pretty good work, right? Pretty good, yeah. Good enough that maybe you'd let a certain someone celebrate with us? <sighs> Fine, but make it quick. The odds were long, the danger close. But between Spider Cop's reckless intuition and the Chief's determined planning, they got the job done. Aw, that's kind of sweet. A pairing of opposites, like peanut butter and chocolate, or breakfast for dinner. The two work together. And we're done. Talk to you later, Spider Cop. She's coming around, right? Yeah. Jeff Jameson gave me this at his Bugle retirement party. I thought nobody would listen to his talk show. Shows how much I know.
and that's that. Every crime tower in the city is now repaired. Pretty good work, right? Pretty good, yeah. Good enough that maybe you'd let a certain someone celebrate with us? <sighs> Fine, but make it quick. The odds were long, the danger close. But between Spider Cop's reckless intuition and the Chief's determined planning, they got the job done. Aw, that's kind of sweet. A pairing of opposites, like peanut butter and chocolate, or breakfast for dinner. The two work together. And we're done. Talk to you later, Spider Cop. She's coming around, right? Yeah, definitely. Alicia's leading me on a chase, but that's what's gonna help me find her. By feeding all the past locations into an algorithm, I can narrow down her likely point of origin. Another cat. I was too late to stop her here, but one or two more locations should give me enough data to pinpoint her hideout. Let any of those bombs explode. Okay, took care of that one. King T'Challa got his powers from being bitten by a radioactive panther. Dude's tough, but that'd still probably hurt. Jameson. Yes, Mr. Jameson. Sorry, spider emergency. And I was almost run over. A 
I understand that Spider-Man saved the kidnapped victim, and I'm glad about that. But I could have been killed. Not just you. This is the problem with that masked maniac. The police are able to coordinate efforts, block streets, lay down tire shredding strips, because they're a team. Spider-Man is a one-man show who cares about one thing. Spider-Man! And you almost paid for that. With your life. Almost forgot I bought this snow globe for Aunt May. I think I get my love for this city from her. why Jonah paid me the big bucks. Bombs aren't going to defuse themselves. Got the blast contained. One more. Just so so. I hope the psychomaniac doesn't think less of me. much time. Okay, took care of that one. One more. Right. Is it bad that I wanted to ace his ridiculous test?
can't let any of those bombs explode. Find the last bomb. Not gonna lie, feeling pretty good about myself right now. Hey, Spider-Man, there's another missing student. Latest MIA is Steve Hopkins. What worries me about him is some guys from Tombstone's gang started dealing in his neighborhood recently. Steve hated that. It's a nice area, but he was too scared to do anything. If he's corrupted, he might take out his anger on them, and he's the one who'd get hurt. This is the last picture Steve put up before he went silent. I couldn't find anything more recent. Huh, pretty sure this is the Upper West Side. I think I need to head north. Do something? Move it, spider jerk! Don't got time! Philip, what can you tell me about Steve? He's a little guy. Wouldn't hurt a fly. I'm not sure he could if he wanted to. Sounds like these dealers would crush him. And a little guy might burn out quicker. I better hurry. I think this park is on the Upper West Side. This Steve guy sounds like he's all responsibility but no power. I hope I can get there in time. Tombstone's gang might not be as bulletproof as their boss, but they're almost as deadly.
think that's the spot over by those trees. Damn, son, you got a death wish? Hey, fellas, let's take college boy to school. That corrupted guy bit off more than he could chew. Guess I have to rescue him before I cure him. Those guys are armed. Maybe I can take some of them quietly. Sleep it off. See that coming. Clear, Steve. Let's get... Steve! Come on, I just saved you! This is what they call tough love. Oh, God. What did I do? I always had a problem with those guys, but... I, I, tonight I wanted to kill him in ways that I don't even want to think about. Don't worry, this wasn't your fault. Peter! Y you okay? <sighs> I'm getting by. I don't know how I feel about you running this place all by yourself. And these people need help. If I lose a few hours of sleep, so be it. So have you heard from Mr. Lee since? <sighs> no. But the Martin I know couldn't have done that. Whatever's become of him, that's not the one I want to remember. So... How are things with MJ? Oh, it's, uh... Well, you know, she's, uh... It's, uh... It's, it's complicated. Honesty. That's what got me and Ben through the rough patches. You guys had rough patches? Oh, sure. Especially when we were your age. So... Are you honest with her? Does she know the real you? Hey! Turn it up! 
I want to hear this. A spokesperson for the police has confirmed that this was the truck carrying the device used in the Grand Central Terminal attack. Oh, it never ends. Peter? Watanabe, leave a message. Yuri, where are you? Call me when you get this. I just hope the Devil's Breath is still there. And still secure. If the demons got to that truck, this just went from bad to catastrophic. mind of the City Hall bombing has finally been brought to justice, and shockingly, it's philanthropist Martin. Now, I'll discuss in a moment what kind of twisted Jekyll and Hyde mentality it takes to lead such a double life. But first, a word of caution to everyone celebrating his arrest. Yes, it's good that he's in jail, but look at all the things we didn't know. How long was he a suspect without anyone telling us? How long did he have a deadly biological weapon that could kill us all? Shouldn't we have been told? Evacuated the city? It's not an accident that we weren't given the information we need to protect ourselves and our families. Someone made that decision. Was it the police? The mayor? I know one guilty party for sure, and his initials are Spider-Man. <laughs> Last ball game Uncle Ben ever took me to. I need to get this framed. I could really use his advice now. Rikers? We have to hurry. Hop on. What happened? It was a coordinated attack. Must have been planned from the outside. Every cell block is breached. We're minutes away from every prisoner and Rikers walking right up Fifth Avenue. What about the raft? Should be okay. It's a supermax facility. Better security and a separate power grid. Good. What about the Devil's Breath? Sable's handling it. Do you trust them? Do I have a choice?
behind that door.
Okay, looks like things are somewhat under control. I thought you said the raft was secure. It was. Let's go. Maybe it's not as bad as it looks. Love the optimism. But in my experience, when it looks bad, it's usually worse. Look out! Ah! Ah! Yuri! I'm flipping! Gotcha! 